All right, I am here with Anisha from the Homecoming Board, uh, and we are going to jump right into these questions if you're ready. Yeah, I am. So, how do you start your day? Um, usually on my phone. I feel like that's the first for most people. All right. So, what's one song that you can listen to on repeat? Yesterday by the Beatles, or pretty much any Billie Eilish song. What's the last movie that made you cry? Um, it's Just Mercy with Michael B. Jordan in it. Yeah. It's a good movie. Yeah. What's your favorite class that you've taken at Virginia Tech? Uh, probably uh, one of my psych classes, like Intro to Psych. Um, made me add a psych major, so yeah. What's one class you wish you could take? Probably something with political theory. Which sounds boring, but... <laughs> What's one food that everyone else seems to love, but you can't stand? You know, I'm actually really not a picky eater. I, I don't really know of anything I can't stand. Usually I'll like mustard it down, but like maybe eggplant, but I feel like people might not like eggplant, but yeah, I choose not to if I can. What three words best describe Virginia Tech? Um, beautiful, it's very pretty. Uh, Challenging and fun. What is something that you still have left to do on the Hokie bucket list? Um, I've never had chicken parm. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so what are you currently watching, reading, or listening to? Um, I was, I just finished um, Education. It's a book by Tara w I, Tara, some, I can't remember her last name, Tara. And then um, I am watching um, Ugly Betty on Hulu, but that's like about it. And then listening, uh, Billie Eilish probably. Where did you grow up? Uh, Springfield, Virginia. And what was it like growing up there? Um, just the typical suburban lifestyle, I guess. Just pretty typical. How would your best friend describe you? Caring. And who do you call when you need life advice? Mom. How do you decompress after a long day? Food and just on the bed, just fall asleep. What's the best gift you've ever received? Oh gosh. Um, it was actually just a card, I feel like, um, but it was really thoughtful. What's the worst fashion trend you've ever participated in? <laughs> um, you know, the, I don't know if you'll remember, but like girls used to have like the leggings with like all the patterns on them, like tri tribal print. Yeah, that was a thing in fifth grade. So <laughs> definitely participated in that. All right. What advice do you have for incoming Hokies? Um, to have fun, but also keep on top of it, your school academic stuff because it is different than high school. I know you can take a billion APs, but it'll be different when you're like not at home and it's different and challenging. So, yeah. What's your favorite memory at Virginia Tech? Uh, probably my 21st birthday, which not for that reason of like 21st, but uh, my 21st birthday happened to fall on homecoming, on the homecoming game. So we were just like, I was up at 4 a.m. on my birthday and a whole bunch of people just really showed up for me. Um, my friends traveled to um, come and see me, so that was nice. What made you join the homecoming board? Um, you know, I think I saw my orientation leader post something on Facebook and I always wanted to get active in student government and all that. So um, I tried out, almost didn't go to the interview because I got so nervous, but I'm glad I did. And here you are, the president. <laughs> if you had a free round trip ticket, where would you travel to? Thailand. And if you were on the plane, would it be window or aisle seat? Uh, aisle. What's the best view on campus? Pylons. Okay. And where's your favorite place to study? Uh, 
that probably like typical third floor of the library. What's your favorite place to eat on campus or in Blacksburg? Uh, West End at Leith and Ladle, the rice bowls. Okay, and I should get the rice bowls if I go there? Yep. <laughs> Have you Anything not Anything else from Leith and Ladle? Um, I usually just get the rice bowls. Okay, good choices. All right, well, that's it. Oh. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Okay, <laughs> that was so fast. Okay, great.